Welcome back to my channel. Sekarang kita mau. You want something? You let me know. Golden. Show me what you got. <coughs> gua nggak bisa kill dia di sini. Jadi maksudnya di jalan. Jadi gua akan ngikutin dia. Coba gua mau lihat ada yang bisa upgrade nggak? Supplies, tactical vest. Tactical modification. No more. Our business is done. You know how to find me. Appreciate it. This day's been a goddamn chore. I'm about ready for my medicine. Moving to Chicago. Can't believe he's leaving the city. Mom expects me to call every week. Yo, 
Oh bener di Bayu Phantom. Go ahead and drive. There's something I need to play for you. You want to hear Marcano tear Uncle Lou a new one? Lou Marcano was bribing a district judge named Cornelius Holden. Is that correct? Sal Marcano spent a lot of money getting Holden in his pocket. A lot of money. Judges like that don't come cheap. And with Holden out of the picture, Sal had to find someone else to legalize gambling. And that person was State Senator Walter Jacobs. That's right. You had one fucking job, Lou. Now it's to keep holding him one goddamn piece to left in that room. What was I supposed to do? He wouldn't listen, Sal. It ain't my fault. Ah, uh, nothing's ever your goddamn fault. I swear, if you wasn't my brother, I'd clip you myself. Now listen here. I know a guy, a state senator named Jacobs. He's on the Revenue and Fiscal Affairs Committee. <laughs> Has a lot of influence. Can we get to him? Already have. He has a thing for fucking on women who ain't his wife. I don't want to twist this guy's balls out of the gate, you understand? We need to be smart about this. Yeah, 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 of course. Uh, how about I throw him a fundraiser on the riverboat? Show him a real nice time. Get him laid. All that shit. This goddamn casino got me tapped, you understand? This goes down to shit or we're fucked. All of us. Well, I'll pick the guests myself. Make sure they know what's what. Then we'll take a nice long cruise down the bayou. Get them all liquored up. Once he sees that payday, Jacobs is gonna do whatever we want. <laughs> Lou Marcano knew everyone. I mean, politicians, merchants, lawyers, bankers. He insisted on being called Uncle Lou. And was basically the Santa Claus of the French ward. According to the police reports, Mr. Marcano and Mr. Jacobs were killed during a fundraiser on a riverboat. The thing about the bayous, it's a very big place. You could blow the living shit out of everything in sight and no one would even notice. <laughs> Ready to go when you are. Assume you already mapped out where the riverboat's gonna go. Lou's pretty fastidious about that kind of thing. Always follows the same path when he goes cruising through the bayou. Doesn't want anything to happen to his beloved Delphine. <laughs> gonna be the least of his problems. Okay, you recon the area? There's an old coal dumper that they have to sail past. I've already got it rigged to blow. You just need to connect the primer cord to each block and then set it off. Detonator's down by your feet. All right. <laughs> 
Isolate and kill. Lincoln Clay specialty. What's wrong? Yeah, it's the boat thing, isn't it? Not saying it is, not saying it ain't. <laughs> you need to get over it. You were on what, 40, 45 PBRs in country? 52. That's not the point. You don't know what it's like to get onto a boat knowing full well the damn thing's gonna sink. It gets old, man. Look, you blow the coal dumper. Boom. It hits the boat. Then you jump on board and kill Lou and those other assholes. 50-50, you don't even get wet. 50-50? 40-60, but still. Thirty seventy at the worst. Okay, Jay. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Go along some magic in line, yeah? Bye.